after creating all the parts of machine wise we'll go for assembly new iso metric assembly then go to parts library where where you choose the folder where you save all the parts okay i have all the 9 10 parts first i'll start with the body part drag and drop the body part first that is the base okay now again body part then i'll insert the movable jaw first either you insert screw rod or movable jaw we'll go for movable jaw approximately you rotate in the same direction where you are okay go to um, the axis of this to axis of this okay now i'll give some mate distance i want to make this plane to this plane before that you give it some distance i'll give 75 then click on mate command this is mate then yeah. this mate for mate i think the dimension is not chosen choose mate this plane to this plane see now the distance is 75 still it is not i'll give first axis then now mate and we have to give planar to planar see now it's fitted we'll go for insert the screw rod now go to screw rod screw rod drag and drop i'll choose this plane this flat plane mate mate with this this portion now it's mated now choose cylinder to cylinder this cylinder to see this cylinder that is axis to axis still it's not constrained why because we have to choose plane r see this is a, there is a construction plane choose that and show reference plane then the construction plane reference planes will be enabled then click this flat plane to any flat plane then automatically it will turns one is axial mate and planar now i will go for okay clamping plate bottom clamping plate right bottom clamping plate here you go for bottom plate complete clamping plate here in the screen itself you rotate approximate directions drag and drop first i'll make with this flat surface to bottom plate of this then make axial axis to axis and this whole axis okay to this whole axis now it's fitted okay now it is fitted again we'll go for washer this side washer first you put the washer rotate it we'll go for mate this plane surface to this plane surface then axis this axis this axis then again construction show reference plane any flat plane to any flat plane either vertical or horizontal now go for nut and lock nut nut m10 same direction drag and drop then mate first this flat surface to 
flat surface then axis in axis in show one reference uh, flat plane to flat okay now again lock nut same fashion same procedure mate flat plane to this flat then axis to this axis flat surface to flat surface now finished now finally we will insert the uh, jaw grip and screws now we will go for jaw grip first jaw grip insert the jaw grip here drag and drop back side mate with this surface then axis to axis then axial align to this hole to this hole right same for this side in jaw grip mate flat surface this flat surface then this axis to this axis then axis to this axis right now insert the screws csk screws for all the three sides go for csk screw i'll insert one side and mirror it later first i'll go for axis axis then mate with this flat surface mate so then you go for one slot here there is a slot now and make it flat for the top side same thing for this side also one more i'll do it later because i want to mirror the component if you have any doubts you can mirror face to face first you mate it then axis to axis then flat zoom it this flat surface cut out is there now just make that flat to any flat reference plate now i'll go for the bottom also bottom clamping plate i'll insert one here csk screw this mate with this mate and axis to axis then zoom out and make this flat to any one flat surface fit now i'll go show the reference plane go to reference plane i'll make it front reference plane enable why i want to mirror the components now go for mirror components choose csk screws okay one two and bottom all the three screws click accept and choose the reference plane where the front reference plane and on that it mirrors click ok click finish see by default this this and this will be mirrored now in only one component we have to insert that is the rod go for library rod m10 drag and drop make this cylinder to axis to axis then 
show reference plane construction display flat to flat and any one flat reference plane to flat reference plane dear friends see my complete machine wise assembly machine wise is ready you will see these things in machine shop or workshop machine to hold the job now i'll save the machine wise assembly and then create 2d before going for creating 2d you have to save the file and click on machine wise assembly click right button go to create drawing then here you choose acit file or any draft file on a4 don't select this isometric only you will also select choose front top and isometric if you want you can wish to say take any side views click ok click place i'll choose one is to two for this afterwards you can make a change the i'll choose 0.5 move still bigger okay side view wish to wish to stay you can i'll delete my front view since i want the sectional front view then go for cutting plane choose top plane then zoom and cut the section from this midpoint line is asking look at the question if it is given full section then draw full section right off right off left off left off like that the cutting plane depends on the what is given in the question now i'll choose my right side then go to section click on the line section section place it now go to select and unselect this unwanted sections suppose i don't want to make section for uh, screw rod then nut then uh, lock nut then all cs old shift press control and select all the csk screws generally the screws and fasteners not supposed to make etching click apply click okay then click on update views it is and section the see nut and bolt screw rod and screws not supposed to hatch sectioning now choose all the views you want now it show the part list for the given drawing click on part list placed here now click right button properties here you delete author i uh, no need to no need for author i want to add material for that material apply okay click material is not added go for material then add column apply okay right place to within the sheet to take print outs suppose you, you don't want that account press control and select all these lines to unselect the number of items count select all these things you switch off this count item count only the part number will be showing okay if you don't want you can delete this line also it showing only then click fit if you give to shade for this click on this click here you can give shaded edges click update views you will see the actual image click save 
machine wise 2d to take print out of this thank you